Welcome back to Dr. Shire Plays Toki Dunky Wami. We're going to fight the boss now. Jesus Christ. You're quick, I just started. Holy crap. Also, hi. So, um, for those of you just joining, you can't stream the sound of this game, so I'm playing the soundtrack on my laptop um, while I'm doing this. I think I'm just going to do the story mission until we can get an absolutely full party. Also, welcome Avalona. Welcome to the stream. So yeah, basically, I'm gonna wait till I get all my party members back before I do those side missions. And then the torpedoes. It's going fairly well. I'm getting pretty tired with all these, like, ass crack of dawn mornings, though. This isn't the worst demon I've seen. Yeah, no problem going on attack here. We have no healers, so we'll see how that works out. If we fail this, I will be a healer next time. Looks like as long as we keep tapping this tail, we're fine, though. Like, it can't hit us if we're like, right up in its guts. Like, damn, this thing only has a frontal attack and it's really dumb. <laughs> Thanks for the host. Someday, I'll stop, like, not knowing what's going on and actually learn how to make Twitch work for me so I don't have to manually do everything. But that day has not come. Okay, you learn how to attack behind you. That kind of sucks for me now, doesn't it? Also, I might switch from a sword to a club or fists just so I can get more damage. It's exactly like Monster Hunter, except you're getting super Japanese-themed demons rather than just random demonic monsters. Like, worst case scenario, at Anime North, you could show me, because I'll have my laptop there. I'm not sure how much I'll be able to do beforehand, as far as figuring things out goes anyway. Uh, this thing has quite a few breakpoints. Oh, I... Oh, jeez, we shattered the crap out of it. Bone of Resentment, Polyhedron Crystal, which is a common boss drop from basically everything, Vow of Love. 
Yeah, I've been going like every year for a decade. Why wouldn't I go? Also, I'm doing another collaborative project with the YouTube channel Gaining Experience. So, if you want to check their channel out, um, we did a collab last year, and you can find that on there. And they also have several of their own series for you to enjoy. I'm hoping that I can get a Nintendo Switch before Anime North so we can play Pokémon and have a fighting tournament. Also, apparently I'm supposed to lick the cartridge because they put a coating on it to stop little kids from swallowing it and it's like a thing to lick the cartridge of a Switch game now. So I'll probably also do that. Unless the person at the sales counter is trolling me. In which case, I'll just lick a cartridge for no reason. Yeah, apparently, the story is that Nintendo coated their Switch games with a substance that makes them taste really nasty, so kids spit them out instead of swallowing their carts. <laughs> As I said, I don't know the validity of this claim. But, I'll try it out, for science. I actually saw that attack coming and dodged it beautifully. It's like I've played this game before. Honestly, this is one of the easier bosses we've encountered all game. Yeah, unfortunately the future that is now is licking game cartridges. So I'm not sure what kind of scientific advancement we're looking at here, but... We've come to the point in human history where licking game cartridges is a thing. I swear I cut an arm off. Where'd it go? There it is. <laughs> The, the real question is, um, like, that means we lived in a world previously where kids did eat games, so what's up with that? If we now live in a world where children don't eat games. Gross. Kids put everything in their mouths. Oh hey, it's Fugaku. I play all the Dragon Ball games, except for Xenoverse and Fighter because they're too expensive and I can't afford them. They're all the Budokai Tenkaichi games. I own all of those.
Are we gonna get like a million allies in this fight now? I was really hoping we'd have, like, eight dudes in the field for this fight. No such luck. Oh, and now the boss actually got hard. Like, it stopped fucking around. I think it also turned upside down and its face turned to vagina, but I'm not sure. It went on the subway diet and lost a little weight like Jared. Unfortunately, his face does look like a vagina. If you've seen uh, Austin Powers Gold Member, that'll make so much more sense. Like, any face you could use like one. I like how Hatsuho actually was looking forward to eating some demon. If she wants to eat demon, she just needs to pull down with Fugaku's trousers. I had a whiff sandwich there, by the way. We're laying the smackdown on it now. Not sure if that was someone else's breaker or if the snake just went Super Saiyan. Oh no, it started belly dancing. Where are you going, snake? Have you no eyes? I think I see how its body shape works now. It has a woman's face, but like on top of the woman's head is the snake face. So it's got a woman's face for a neck. And it's just always looking straight up, except when it gets super mad. Or fan theory, its face just turns into vagina. Check when you prefer. Yeah, so you see how its tail's a ghost? We can keep breaking it, but we don't get any parts for it beyond the first time. But every time we break it, we do heavier damage. So it's good to keep breaking the same part off over and over again if you want to just deal damage. Because, so okay, so this is how demons work in this game. Their physical body is like armor. And their, and their magical body, which is the ghost limbs, is like their actual flesh. So you do diddly dick for damage when you hit its armor. You have to break the armor off and then hit the exposed points to do HP damage. So that's why I'm aiming for its tail all the time as much as I can. 
because it's the easiest part to reach that does HP damage. And we broke all the parts off so we can't get any more material from it. Some bosses can regrow the armor, but most of them can't. Iwakura Tomomi. Ice Sparkle Scale. Looks like we didn't miss any items. There's a shrine there that we didn't use. Well, this is a neat little chapter, for sure. Glacia Bella Horns. Oh, we're two over. Um, hmm. We can probably sell this safely because we have a whole lot of them. I have truth masks aren't that hard to get. But I'd prefer to sell something. Yeah, black sand is probably safe to sell. We really need to expand our inventory again. I will blow wind through this age. You gonna kill everyone with a fart attack? That sounds like a story and a half. Also, look at all the characters we have now. Remember that time we had to play through eight chapters with only like six characters? Uh, the space is where your farts went. Oh, Kuyo's so pissed, though. Well, you should take a screenshot of this then, real quick. If you want to make these outfits. Oh, uh, well, we just escaped the uh, snow cave area. Oh, okay. Sorry about being so late. We got stuck in a lab. The oscilloscope wouldn't work properly. That's unfortunate. We fixed it. There was some voltage issues we were dealing with. It's all very old equipment. I think the oscilloscope was manufactured in 1999. Well, it's seen all its continuous use as well. Uh, yes and no. I mean, I don't know if I'd say continuous, but we've seen a lot of fucking use. Like, mother of God. But, at any rate, how is uh, Tokiden going? Uh, we... Fought a new boss type. It was pretty easy. Um, probably the easiest boss out of all of the ones we had to fight. Which is hilarious, because it was one of the few that we didn't have to solo. 
It's pretty easy, much like your mother. Indeed. Well, now we're going to have a secret ninja discussion. Secret ninja discussion? He's a secret ninja man? A secret Asian man? Potentially. It doesn't have to be Asian to be a ninja. Dig it. I don't know. He was a true ninja. I just did the Ninja 65 quest, so I just uh, saw the face of a true ninja, apparently. Um. Oh god, what was that, what was that asshole's name? Is it Kirasu, or is it his... Uh... No, it's, it's the guy that uh, blew Kirasu apart. Oh, that bitch. Okay, yeah. Fuckface, although, I remember him. Although, uh, Kurasu, uh, probably just using its semi, like he always does. Maybe, I wish I had used the semi. Yeah, you have it in 11, and it's awesome. 